And now, First Warn 5 Weather with meteorologist Samara Kokinos. It is 642 on this Thursday morning. We're waking up to cloudy skies, cool temperatures and a little bit of rain. So as you head out the door, jackets and umbrellas definitely are great accessories for today. The Doppler network showing starting in Doggo County mainly dry, but we look over here along the coast and things are a little bit different in Cameron County. Been watching uh, some scattered showers, mainly light rain, but there have been pockets of moderate to heavy rain falling. So 100 is pretty wet from sh showers this morning. Also I 69 E as you head down into Brownsville, definitely a little bit wet there and in Port Isabel and along the island. Zooming up a little bit closer here, you can see the current activity uh, making its way southwest over toward Latina Ranch and also the Bayview area. And so it is headed south and west. So Los Fresnos and even Brownsville, maybe even Ranchito getting a little bit of rain this morning. Uh, it looks like Port Mansfield has dodged a lot of it, but I can't rule out maybe some light showers there as well. The roads are going to be a little bit slick. Please give yourself a little bit of extra drive time. And now when I say it's cool, it's not, it's kind of like the same as it was yesterday, but I'll show you the difference in a second. Right around 63 degrees in La Gloria. Good morning to you in Alamo, where you're checking in at 67. It's 65 in Lyford and 66 in Santa Maria. The difference is the wind speeds this morning. They're mainly out of the north northwest and they're elevated anywhere between about six miles per hour up to 17 miles per hour. So you will have the wind gusts to deal with as well, and the winds are going to stay Stay pretty breezy today again out of the north anywhere between 12 and 20 miles per hour and gusting a little bit higher than that from time to time so that makes it feel a little bit cooler add in a few spotty showers and yeah it does feel a little chilly out there today so we'll go from 65 this morning up to 70 degrees by noon and then 72 is your daytime high we're back in the 70s and upper 60s for your drive time home. So it looks like uh, here's what the shower activity in the main area is going to get the rain lower valley and along the coast today and notice that with any passing shower that does make it into uh, eastern Hidalgo County around 11 10 or 11 o'clock this morning. Uh, you could get a little bit of moderate rain. Same thing over near Port Mansfield. But again, a lot of this looks to be light rain as we head into the afternoon. Mid to upper valley could get a few showers as well, but I think the lower valley and the coast will be the best places to see a lot of this shower activity. Uh, Upper Valley just getting a few stray showers, but again, those mainly cloudy skies staying in place, courtesy of the upper level winds, mainly out of the southwest. So when we get that flow, it's a warmer flow compared to what we're dealing with here at the surface. That puts that blanket of clouds over us, and it also gives us a chance for those showers. That particular system is going to start to move to the north and east, so we're going to continue with the cloudy skies and a few showers, especially along the coast with a little coastal disturbance developing. Below average temperatures will also also continue, but then once high pressure sinks into the valley starting early next week, we will get a little bit more sunshine and slightly warmer weather over the next couple of days. You're going to notice that difference because our dew point values are going to go down. It's going to feel a lot more like fall. Along the coast today, a small craft advisory is in place for the Gulf waters until midnight tonight. Along the bay, you need to exercise caution. It will be choppy out there. The gusty winds causing those seas to become elevated between about 5 and 8 feet. Here's your first warm 5 7 day forecast. 72 today, 60 tonight. A few showers tomorrow for Veterans Day. High temperatures right around 74. Showers will continue as we head into the weekend. Your dew point values will go down to the upper 50s and eventually to the low 50s this weekend. So 73 and 74 will be feeling a diff bit different, cooler. Overnight lows in the upper 50s will feel chilly, so be ready to have jackets for overnight. Now you head into next week, that's when you start to see more sunshine. Temperatures get a little bit warmer. 80 on Monday, we're 84 by Tuesday and Wednesday. That's your updated first one five forecast.